and I had to detach myself from like, for example, like I, I got, we got pulled over by cops. Um, I went to a very, very good school because I was really, really good at sports. <laughs> and it was four of us in the car. We're all black, good at sports, a, a D1 school. Only one of us had a car, so we had to drive together, right? Pull over, harassed, did all that stuff. When he found out, the cop found out we went to the school, we was about to get in our car. He told us to lower the music because it's a nice neighborhood. We're just bumping mob deep, right? Um, <laughs> so, so I asked him, I said, hey, this didn't go well. He goes, how do you expect it to go? I'm like, well. I'm like, can I go on a ride along with you? He goes, what are you doing inside? I was like, I'm good. He came and he picked me up. And he, he was smart enough to drive me around my neighborhood. Who's that, the cop? A cop. He drove me around my neighborhood. <clears throat> And I saw what, what he had to go through. He dropped me home and I go, I can't be a cop. I would have shot eight person. I would have shot eight people today. I, I would have I just shot eight people today. I don't have the patience for that. He goes, we're trained not to shoot people. Now, they are being called to a situation that one person needs their help and one person doesn't want them there every time. It's like an like a, a energy that's just toxic. And they have to go and assess it and protect them because they have a wife and kid at home. There's all these things that's happening, and a lot of times when they're going there, it's it's already hostile. There's already there's already a scene. it's always a hostile situation, and like it's like, and it's tense, and that's what they do every. Si- so when I saw that, whenever I got pulled over, I always think about one, who's representing me. It's all like these rappers and celebrities on TV. So the cop already thinks I'm a shithead. Right? Because we don't have people up top that's, like, representing us with, like, class. Right? People are twerking and doing all this shit. Two, it's, like, the next person this guy pulls over, I owe it to that other um, black kid for him to have a good experience. Three. I like that. That's three, a, a this one. is not my country. You know why? Because every, every, everywhere that I step, everybody who's in a high position is not my color. That's how you know that you're not home. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So... So it's like whenever, like, I got pulled over, it was always like, how can I make this guy invite me over for dinner? It only happened a few times, but I've never gotten a ticket in my life because I understood them, like, what they had to go through. And I told them that. It's like, dude, I would never want to do your job. Like, thank you for slowing me down. Like, I'll take the ticket. How like, do you feel about like 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 my life is important? I shouldn't be speeding anywhere or running through a stop sign. Like, and I just I just understood it. There was no ang- anger about like you're pulling me over because I'm black. Of course you are. Like, we haven't learned how to like live with each other because it's always been toxic slavery and trying to read through it. We don't know each other that well yet, but we're doing a great job. So, it's like I know that he is uncomfortable. And before I, I, w- I had like 20 more pounds of like, you know, muscle because I played football. And it, it's like, of course he's tense. Like I can end his life. So for us to, ha- to, to have a conversation, it's just like a human like, you know, interaction. I've never gotten a ticket. And I've done a lot of things. I've been caught with stuff in the car as well. I've like... It's just a way that y- your mindset has to be in every single situation. So if you are a creator, everything you're responsible for, the world you live in, you're responsible for. If I get pulled over, I'm responsible for that cop, how, he, how she or he's going to feel. It, like, if it's a woman, don't worry, worry about it. Like, I'm, like, she's, like, she's, Do you like, think it's too, like, 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 people, like, she's letting me go. People, nah. people like, would say that by doing that, like, not, like, how many times do they have to do it? You know, it, and it's it, and there has to be a time where move to Africa. You're tired of being pulled over. Move to Africa. Everybody's black. People still get pulled over the same amount of time. It's like you you have to like when I drive, my energy when I'm driving matters too. Like we know energy is real, but like we pick and choose when we want to use it. Right. So your answer is to have them go to Africa? No, no, I'm just joking. I'm oh, just joking. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying like black people are saying I get pulled over because I'm black. Yeah. It's like go to places where there's only black people. You'll still get pulled over. Okay. So so even if it's true here, I'm not denying like cops pull you over because you're black. Okay. But most likely they have dealt with other black people before you. So 
as a culture, we're not helping ourselves to, like, follow the fucking law. Like, everybody that we have held up as a martyr has been a criminal this year. We're the only race that does that. Like, it makes me want to cry. Like, we're the only race that, like, put criminals on T-shirts. Yeah. And, it, and there's so many good black people that are just doing great shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And then the white media blasts that because it's their, they can't use the KKK no more. But now they can use that to say, you see, racism. So you need us. So like you're using it as a for a crutch. like we're not strong enough. Like like we should be even if there's racism, you should be strong stronger than racism. You should be. That's fucking awesome. Like it, it, like a, 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 a like a uh, um a, a race limits their joy on this planet. If you hate me because of my color, you just limit your experience with like, life in in life. It's so it's like it, it's a harm on them, not on you. Well, what do you think about? Th- the government having to pay all black people reparations for way back when. You know what I think? Maybe back then it would have worked. Right now it would be a race of money. Well, well, it would because... They would buy... Playstations. They would buy Gucci. <laughs> and drugs. And things I like swear. That. Like, yeah. I mean, back then, yes, right now it would be a race of money. Because here's the thing. If you split up all the money evenly, after a certain amount of years, it's going to end up in the same hands that it was in anyway. Yeah. So, so, so it's not that there's no opportunities. Like, there are somebody who's born with all the money in the world. They have to deal with so much shit. But, like, we don't see that because we're like, oh, you have all the money. Just because we don't. But, like, the values that we have by, by having to, like, like, we live a full life by just having to hustle and just, like, zigzag. They're not having that much fun. They got to pay for it. Like, we are the best character in, in the movie here. Yeah. So, so this, like, hatred of someone because, like, for example, like, Barack won. I was happy for him. I wasn't happy for me. Not because he was black. I'm like, oh, man, like, seems like a really cool dude. Like, he, he worked hard and, and, you know, like, he, he got there. Trump won. I was like, holy shit. Ooh.